Is your little one a picky eater? Are you worried about their nutrition? Tired of all that mealtime drama? Well, now you can actually hire a coach to teach your kid how to eat a healthy diet. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez has the story on this growing trend. For Debbie Williams, mealtime with five-year-old Maya isn't always this peaceful. She prefers pizza and hot dogs. If I put foods that would challenge her a little bit, like vegetables, a lot of drama, just crying, I don't want to eat that. And it was more than drama. Maya wasn't gaining weight, and her pediatrician was concerned about her growth. I was at a place where I didn't know what to do anymore. It was becoming so stressful that we try to get her to eat and try new foods, and she'll gag and she'll throw up, and nobody wants to have dinner like that every single night. So Debbie hired a coach to work with Maya on her picky eating. Is good. It's a trend some experts say is growing. I've certainly seen quite the increase in the more garden variety picky eater on my caseload. When I first sit down with little kids, I explain to them that I'm a food coach. They have soccer coaches, they might have a softball coach, and I'm here to help them learn about new foods. The coach's approach is to incorporate games and encourage children to take small samples of unfamiliar foods. I am a therapist that brings toys to the table. Over time, we slowly fade the toy out of the picture. Sometimes bringing in an expert makes all the difference. A lot of times we will kind of say a lot of the same things that the parents are, are saying to the child, um, but we're in a non parental role and they respond positively. Every week there's more and more foods that at least she's willing to try. So we're happy. Even if a child decides not to eat a specific food, it's important to keep trying. Experts say it can take as many as 10 or 12 tries of a new food before a child will accept it. Be patient. A healthy diet is not built overnight. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News. Easier said than done, doctor. Well, experts also suggest getting your kids involved in the preparation of healthy foods. And you know what? That outside voice mm -hmm. could be helpful, yeah, right? It really could. Because after all, as our kids say, we don't know anything. Somehow it ma creates magic when we someone else says it. That's right.